okay lumbar discus okay mid ear yeah uh, uh, this is a this is a normal trick that one uses in grid theory calculations all the time whenever you need this you can shift the this dy tau of here or any derivative of a function you take a partial derivative and you get a total derivative term which vanishes at the infinite space and time boundaries here we don't have space but we have time boundary so this term would vanish at the infinite time boundaries and this term would survive so we have these two terms okay very good <laughs> and now so now i need to differentiate it once again so this term is there plus one half of minus two uh, and <coughs> there should still be a factor of d tau this d tau uh, should still be there okay so minus two uh delta s mu d tau is of course there and one half minus two delta x mu yes so i want to differentiate these two terms the product of these two okay i want to differentiate the product of this and this would be uh mm -hmm. what i'm doing is i am missing so the okay so del tau of eta mu nu times x nu dot plus del tau of x nu dot so this is x nu double dot into eta mu right this term is my x mu x mu double dot into eta mu mu plus this term okay and here this del tau of eta mu nu i once again would use uh, this trick of let let me write it separately here so then tau of theta mu nu is equal to del k of theta mu nu del tau of x k and this is del k theta mu nu x k dot okay i think let's let's take stock of the all the terms we started off with this term so we have this term plus this term and this this term could be written as this now we we interchange these two because they are infinite decimal operators delta and delta both are infinite decimal and therefore we could change the ordering and then uh, this is okay then we took one partial integration to shift this time derivative on this to this time derivative of this with a minus sign plus a total derivative term okay and then we have differentiated product of these two okay so delta of this times this plus delta of x nu dot into this and here we again play this trick of 
this in general is very helpful in the tensor calculus okay so <coughs> now is this fine okay so we need to collect all these terms and we need to put them back okay and now we do this so uh, also I think I think let us first collect these terms okay so if you allow me I can erase these terms yes yes is this okay Lambert yes. so I erase these terms from here and let me collect all the terms for delta s so now i get as follows one half d tau delta x mu times there is one term with x double dot nu which is multiplied by eta mu nu minus twice of del k of eta mu nu times x k dot x nu dot plus del mu of eta o with at one point uh, let me write one step separately here okay i write one term separately here and what is this term this is x mu dot x nu dot times del k eta mu nu This is a term. Is this this term? This is one of the terms x nu dot x nu dot uh, delta of eta and did I miss something here? One one half d tau x mu dot x mu dot and delta of eta yes and this had given me 